In earlier versions of Microsoft PowerPoint, you could create a template for a specific design style and apply that design template to an existing presentation. Microsoft PowerPoint 2007 is a little different. In this newer version, what used to be called design templates are now known as themes. Themes and templates are similar, but they have slightly different uses. A template is like a pattern or a blueprint for your slides when you're building a presentation from scratch. Themes are a collection of complementary colors, fonts, and design elements that can be applied to a presentation once it's built. A template can include theme colors and fonts, theme effects, and background colors, as well as specific layout elements. Microsoft PowerPoint comes with a number of built-in templates that you might find useful. When you click on the Office button and select New to create a new presentation, look for the Installed Templates option in the dialog box. When you select Installed Template, you'll see a list of thumbnails for the built-in options. Just select one that you like and click Create. PowerPoint will open your new presentation in Normal View so you can see the thumbnails for the different layout pages in the Slides pane on the left. And then you can start adding your own content to the built-in template. So for example, in this first slide, I can place my cursor in the built-in text boxes, highlight the text, and type in my new text. You can also save your own custom template if you've created a presentation that you like and you want to use the same blueprint in future presentations. You may want to first save the file under a new name so you don't accidentally overwrite your original presentation. Then in the New File, go up to the View tab in the top navigation and select the Slide Sorter view. Now delete all the slides in the active presentation on your screen. The easiest way to do this is to press the Control key and the letter A at the same time to highlight all of the thumbnails, and then just hit the Delete key. Next, press Control plus the letter M twice to insert two blank slides for your new template. The first slide will be a title slide, and the second will be for title and content. Don't make any changes to these slides, we're just setting up the template for now. Finally, click the Office button in the top left corner of your screen and choose Save As, then select Other Formats. In the dialog box, name your template file, and then open the pull-down menu for Save as File Type, and select PowerPoint Template. Then click Save. Now the template you created will be available to use when you create a new presentation. So I can go up to the Office button and select New. Then in the Templates list, I'll select My Templates. Here in the preview, I can see the template that I just created and select that one. You can create a template from an existing presentation, but if you have a presentation open and you want to apply a different design, you actually have to use a theme. So in addition to saving your new design as a template, you may also want to save it as a custom theme to have it available for other presentations. To do this, mouse click on the Design tab in the top navigation and click the arrow to open the drop-down menu for the Themes group. The template you're working from will be the first thumbnail on the menu, but it hasn't been saved as a theme yet, so that's what you need to do. In the bottom of the menu, just click on Save Current Theme, and in the dialog box, give it an appropriate file name, then click Save. Now when you open an existing presentation, you can choose the theme that you just created from your template and apply it to some or all of the slides in that presentation. Here's a quick demonstration. I'm going to open another PowerPoint presentation that I've already created. Then I'll go up to the View tab and select Slide Sorter so I can see all the thumbnails. If I want to apply the theme to just some of the slides, I can highlight only those thumbnails, but I'm going to apply it to my whole presentation, so actually I won't highlight any of the slides. Then I'll select the Design tab in the top navigation, and I'll open the menu for the Themes group. Here under Custom Themes, I can see the theme that I just created from my new template. So I'll just click on that theme, and I can see that all of my slides here in the Slide Sorter view change to reflect the new design. Themes and templates give you a lot of control over the look of your presentations, and they make it easy for you to recreate the same design styles for multiple presentations. With the latest version of Microsoft PowerPoint, you can change the whole look for your presentation with just a few easy clicks.